Nah, nah, man. See, if you want to read a woman, man, what you got to do is you got to check her body language. Oh, uh, here you go. No, I'm not. Let, just listen. Now, look. If a girl puts her hair up, man, and she lets it fall real quick, uh -huh. it's a clear signal she's ready for a little extracurricular activity. Uh-oh. <laughs> or she lost her scrunchie. <laughs> A what? Yeah, you know little twisty thing for their hair? <laughs> Don't you ever watch Moesha? No, 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 no. Listen here. Here's one. All right, you at a bar with a woman. She got a drink in her hand. Okay, right. okay. You take a sip and get some ice in her mouth. Mm -hmm. Okay. Roll it around. Mm -hmm. And then drop it back in the glass. If that ain't a signal, I don't know what that's it is. That's what I'm talking about. Right? Thank you. Yeah, that's a signal she ain't got no front teeth. Wait a minute. Hey, hey, let me tell you something, man. Pay very close attention to an accidental touch, because when it moves into a subtle rub, uh -huh. that's a touchdown, dog. Uh-oh. Okay. Uh -oh. <laughs> Score, baby. Score. Yeah, man. What about a hiccup? Anything in that? <laughs> I'm going to give you the Super Bowl of all female mating signals. Okay. Break it for me. Run it down, baby. Run it down. She slides her shoe off of her heel. Yeah, yeah. Slowly, man. Slowly. <laughs> and she lets it dangle. Oh! That's what I'm All talking right, talk about. To oh, me. Yeah. It says, wouldn't these pumps look nice on the floor next to your sneakers? <laughs> or your drawers? Oh! <laughs> oh, I'm oh, I'm oh, 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 better than that. Better than that. The best one right, right here. Go. Kick, kick it. Go ahead. She calls. Yeah. OK. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> and? I mean, that's it. I mean, I mean, that gets me every time, so I'm like, hey, girl. <laughs> no, just waiting for your car. Yeah, yeah. It in the family. Here we go. That's how it's supposed to be. Between brothers, y'all. No one yeah. else can hang with me. You're my brother. Like you're my brother and I love you for the things you do Even when we disagree, I got your back for you Wouldn't trade you for the city if it came with the key Between brothers, yo, no one else can hang with me Cause we keep it in the family oh, right. That no one else can hang with me like my brother Between brothers, yo. Between brothers. Man, Look at I this. wouldn't even pay his salary. This dude sticks. American League pitching. You I, mean, I told you about this. This is a boring game. Mm -hmm. You know what? Baseball needs new rules. Huh? Yeah, man. Like, suppose you can tackle the pitcher. What? <laughs> Come on, man. He puts it too far out left. You just rush the mound. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know what, man? In that case, we should change rules for every sport, man. Like, with basketball, one guy on every team should wear rollerblades. Hey, hey, I like where you're going with that, man. See, because that opens up the door for a lot of brothers who are 5'6". Because uh, you put some blades on me, watch me go baseline. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, what about boxing? How about in boxing, every couple of rounds, the ref gets to throw a few punches? Oh, I like that. <laughs> hey, and whoever, just get right. in there. Let's yeah. go. Yeah. 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 Okay, okay. okay. Here we go. Three light beers mm -hmm. and an iced tea. Oh, cool. Terry, are you okay? Uh-huh. Why? You gave me an iced tea with a twist of onion ring. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll get you another one. Okay. Mm -hmm. I wonder what's up with her, man. I heard she broke up with Mike. What? Yeah, poor Terry. Wow. Mm. Single Terry. <laughs> Lonely Terry. Stop it. Stop it right there. I know exactly what y'all thinking. What? Don't even go there. Come on. Hey, to know what we think it means you had to go there first. Right. <laughs> Mitchell. Terry is our friend. What she needs now is space. So let's let the lady heal. Man, I can help her heal. Call me Dr. Feelgood, cuz uh, I make house calls. <laughs> yeah, I heard you ring that doorbell a little bit too quickly. <laughs> now you Stop it now. Stop it, stop. Terry is our friend, all right? Once you cross that line, you can't go back. Charles. Thank you. Okay. Uh, hey, um, Terry, I'm sorry to hear about you and Mike. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you, James. Hey, babe, do you really think it's over? Well, you know, we split up the CDs and we are discussing custody of the cat. Mm -hmm. It's always the kitties that suffer most. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, it's probably for the best. That's right. If he was acting up, he was no good for you. Yeah, and I'm sure that somebody better will come along. <laughs> I hope so. Someone tall, <laughs> athletic, funny. Sensitive. <laughs> and you know, great in bed. Wow. Oh, yeah. 
Man, you know what, man? Mike was just looks, money, and a Mercedes. I mean, what did she ever see in him anyway? Hey, I hear you, man. Imagine him breaking up with a fine woman like Terry. The boy just was not thinking. Mm -mm. And she is fine as frog's hair. <laughs> <laughs> Not only that, man, she's one of the guys, you yeah, know? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. To Terry. Yeah, to our girl Terry. Hey, yeah. to T. <laughs> See, she's T, I'm DC, y'all wouldn't understand. Uh, <laughs> all right, DC, James Mitchell, I got work to do. I'll okay, catch y'all later. Man. Be hey, cool, sure. big bro. All right. Hey, Charles. What? Can I ask you a favor? Sure. I could really use some help moving some of my stuff out of Mike's apartment. Do you mind? Oh, uh, tomorrow night sounds good? Yeah, that'd be great. All right. I'll see you then. Thank you. Uh, single Terry. <clears throat> Lonely Terry. <laughs> James and Terry. you needed a little cheering up. Well, that is very... Sensitive? Yes. Yeah. Yes, it is. Because that's what I am. I'm your <laughs> sensitive and funny friend, James. Thank <laughs> Not you. funny like that, but... <laughs> no, <I know>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. <gasps> Mitchell! These are incredible. Just a little something-something pudding pop. <laughs> From here. Thank you. Everybody is being so sweet to me. I know. I I'm going to go to the kitchen. Do that. Okay. Well, what the hell are you doing? I'm just being sensitive, okay? A bigger, more fragrant version of sensitive. <laughs> hey, I thought we were backing off of Terry. Yeah, well, you should have thought of that before you gave her that bundle of twigs. <laughs> Size isn't everything. You, of all people, should know that. <laughs> that one of these, right? Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> What the hell is this? I don't know. They were there when I sat down, dog. Oh, <laughs> hey, fellas. <laughs> Dusty, you look like a tan Will Rogers, man. What's with them boots? Are these? <laughs> Just a little something I picked up, slipped on. Can't get off. I guess it's just a coincidence that Terry likes tall guys and you come in here looking like a fool on stilts. Yeah, looking like RuPaul at a rodeo. <laughs> Very funny. Very. F you go ahead and make your jokes, all right? But Terry is sending Dusty Canyon a few signals. <laughs> she wants to take a hike in the canyon. <laughs> she wants to take a bite of the dust. <laughs> you two are just jealous of what I've got. And what have you got besides four inches on G.I. Joe? <laughs> oh, I've got a fire in the canyon. And Terry sees the smoke. <laughs> Come on, man. What makes you think you're the guy for Terry? But you heard her talking about the perfect man. I mean, sensitive, funny, tall. I, mean, I didn't know it till yesterday, but uh, Terry's got a little thing for me. And it's electric. Yeah, she trades you in for something electric. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, Terry, I'm looking. <laughs> more than a weatherman in pumps to get with a woman like Terry, okay? Yeah, well, clearly you think it takes more than half a bottle of cologne, man. You smell. It's not a half a bottle of cologne, man. They're samples. <laughs> well, Y'all just sit back and prepare to get schooled. All right? Ooh. Hey, Terry. Hey, Mitchell. Hey, I know you're going through a hard time. Well, if you need anything, you just come to me, okay? Because I'm your man. Your M-A-N. <laughs> ah. I'm your guy. Your G-U-Y. And I'm on the what? <laughs> Job. J-O-B. Hey, Mitchell. Yeah. Hey, Mitchell. Hey, Mitchell. Hey, Mitchell. Hey, Thank you, Mitchell. Are you done? That depends on you. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you walking away? Uh, you struck out, uh, O-U-T. <laughs> hey, Terry, you ready to go? Yeah, just give me a minute, OK? All right. Hey, little bro. Uh, excuse me, man. What? what? What was all that back there? Who was what? Terry, you ready to go? I'm picking her up and doing a little favor for oh. her. Yeah, man, I can't believe uh -huh. you, man. <laughs> Mr. Give her some space, let her heal, is sneaking around with uh, Terry on. Hey, 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 right there. Don't no, even try. I'm not try sneaking it. around I with I know you, Charles. I'm doing a favor for you. Act like a prayer. <sighs> 
Okay. Come on, let's go. Hey, man. Yeah, right. See you later. Yeah, we know what you're up to. It's mm -hmm. obvious. Mm -hmm. And he's using the Mr. Sensitive Guy routine to get the inside track with Terry. I use it all the time. Man, <laughs> that boy is so transparent. <laughs> I can't feel my toes. <laughs> Charles, thank you for coming all the way down here with me. I can't believe I forgot my purse. Here it is. And you know the worst part about being single again is having to date. Oh, no, it's not that bad. Oh, really? You remember Frederick? He said he was with the bears. Oh, and it turned out he worked for the zoo. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, what ever happened to um, Sandra? Sandra didn't work out. I'm more of a morning person. Mm -hmm. Sandra was more of a... Psychotic. <laughs> so Sandra's gone? Sandra's gone. Just like Mike. Mike and Sandra, both gone. You know it's getting late. Yeah. Yeah. I gotta get home. Yeah, that's... Uh... machine. The ice, well, that's good. It's getting a little hot in here. Um, <laughs> we should... I think we should go. Go, yeah. Yeah. All right, ladies first. Uh, no, I lock. Oh, but then I... You... Oh, yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Hey, did y'all see that, man? Terry's been sending me major signals, man. She switched her server tray from the right hand to the left. <laughs> Think y'all know what that means. That you're an idiot? <laughs> see, that's why you always sit home alone on Friday nights, man. Because you don't pay attention to detail. Now, look, when you add the hair flip and the eyelash thing, man, you got a woman who's on a mission called Operation James. <laughs> Let me tell you something. I'm a skinny love missile, OK? And my sights are locked on Terry. Sure. Hey, Terry. Mm -hmm. There's a dance at my school Friday night. It's a seventh grade mixer, but don't trip on that. <laughs> now, one of the chaperones can't make it. Miss Palmer caught prickly heat. Yeah, she's itching like a jailhouse cat. Mitchell, why are you telling me this? Well, I was just thinking maybe you might want to replace her. You know, look behind the bleachers, you know, break into the girl's bathroom unannounced, you know. <laughs> now, what girl couldn't resist an evening like that? That sounds like fun. Cool. Uh, what bus do I take to your house? Hey, will you look at that fool wasting his time on my girl? Oh, your girl? Uh, yeah. See, she's gonna give me her opinion on one of the condos I'm trying to sell. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, Saturday night, man, it'll be just me, Terry, and a romantic view of the city. Yeah, is that so? Mm hmm Well, you're gonna have to enjoy that view all by yourself, because the Canyon Man is making his move. <laughs> yeah? Oh, yeah. What move is that? Oh, man, I got plans, you know, I got blueprints. <laughs> I got no idea. <laughs> Charles. Terry. Hi. Hi. Uh, Thank you for last night. Oh, well, you know, one of us had to be the strong one. You know, we're friends. We're good friends. Uh, well, actually, I, I, meant, I meant helping me move my stuff. Me too. Oh. Yeah, we, you know, strong, one, heavy stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, I'm gonna go on and sit down. Okay. All right. <laughs> Great teacher. The kids really seem to like you. Yeah? Why do you think that? Oh, you know, because of the way that they picked you up and passed you around the room over their heads like that. Yeah, that's just a little thing we do, you know. Uh-huh. You didn't happen to see the kid that did that, did you? So, Mitchell, were you that wild as a kid? Yeah, I was kind of wild. Yeah, I was this little skinny kid with this big giant afro. Looked like a dirty Q-tip. <laughs> friend and things change and suddenly you find yourself attracted to them yeah but you know you don't want to move too fast because that would just ruin everything exactly yeah i've been there 
Then there's a part of you that just wants it to happen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Been there. Hey, Terry. <laughs> hey, Dusty. It's the end of my shift, but can I get you something? No, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm just on my way home from doing another installment of Dusty Canyon's Wonderful World of Weather. <laughs> and just thought I'd come by to see you. <laughs> oh, you're sweet. Well, you, you make it easy to be sweet. <laughs> in your pocket? Uh, just my little Dusty. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me? Uh, no, <laughs> it's just, you know, boom. It's a little, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a little Dusty Canyon. See, he's got the jacket and everything. It's just, <laughs> <laughs> the uh, station gives him away as a promotion. <laughs> he is so cute. No, what's that? Little Dusty thinks you're cute, too. <laughs> got a mind of his own. Just off the mind. <laughs> Wow, I can't believe you came all the way down here just to cheer me up. Well, I mean, you you seem distracted, so just... Oh, I don't want to bore you with no, this. No, you're not boring me. You're not boring me. No, I, I should go punch out. Thank you. Oh, well, take care, little Dusty. man. <laughs> he doesn't like to sleep alone. <laughs> He's used to it, <laughs> but he doesn't like it. <laughs> just thought uh, maybe you could tell me what I could do to uh, warm the place up. Wow, look at that view. Mm hmm. Oh, the city, yeah, yeah. It's romantic, isn't it? Uh huh. James, can I ask you something? Anything, baby, go ahead. You know, when a man and a woman are friends, sometimes other feelings can develop. Do I? And even though you don't want to ruin a good friendship, sometimes those feelings can be pretty overwhelming, and so you just don't know what to do. Yeah. Um, I say, uh, you go with those feelings. What's that? What, that? Um, that's for us. <laughs> I take it this is your idea of warming the place up? Come on, Terry, I've seen all the signals. Hey, look, don't be afraid. Release the freak. <laughs> Oh, Terry, you yourself said that sometimes these feelings can be uh, Over overwhelming. That's it. That's it. See, that's what's happening here. You know what, James? Maybe you're right. I am? Uh, I mean, of course I am. <laughs> About which part exactly? Well, you know, I mean, we are here and we are alone. Mm -hmm. What do you say we go out on the balcony and uh, enjoy the Enjoy the view. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead, Terry. Hey, look, you know, this is a side of you I've never seen before. James, you have no idea. That's, that's about it. <laughs> ah, little freaky cat and mouse game, huh? Come on. Hey, come on, you really locked the door for real? <laughs> oh, no, she didn't. Terry, you better come open this door. Terry. Mind your business, man. <laughs> hey, y'all, check this. What's up? <laughs> I get a call from Terry. Come down to the condo, she says. I get there, and who's standing outside shivering like a fudge sickle? And you took your sweet time, too. Yes, I did. I knew it was cold. I didn't care. <laughs> hey, you know what, man? I'm going to tell you, man. I'm confused. I mean, I know Terry wants one of us, but... The confusing part is, I'm starting to think that it's not me. Yeah, that's the problem with women. They always send a mixed signals. One minute you think you're clear for takeoff, the next minute is, Houston, we got a problem. Yeah. Yeah. So maybe Terry just doesn't know what she wants. Or maybe she does know what she wants and it's not any of you. Now, how do you know? I just know. Who are you, Yoda? <laughs> you know what? I've seen that smile before, man. Terry was going on about some friend. Mm -hmm. It wasn't a friend, it was Charles. Wait a minute, Terry was talking about me? Yeah. What, what did she say? Man, something about being overwhelmed with friendship and being overwhelmed by feelings or over... Man, she was overwhelmed with something. 
<laughs> then all I know, I'm outside freezing my behind off, being overwhelmed by the damn cold. <laughs> Is this a bad time? Yeah. As a matter of fact, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Why don't we talk out here? Okay. I feel so stupid. I'm so embarrassed, man. I want my doll back. Mike called. He wants to get back together. I'm not moving that piano again. <laughs> no. I just, I don't know if things are going to work with him. Well, give it some time. You owe it to yourself to find out. Yeah, you're right. So we're okay? Oh, yeah, definitely. We're good friends. We don't need to mess with that. Give me some debt. <laughs> nah, I don't even try it. <laughs> <laughs> She's leaving. She's leaving. I can't believe it, man. He's just sending her down the road. <laughs> Incoming. Oh, uh, uh, watch the. <laughs> so, uh, how much did y'all hear? Pretty much everything. That's what I feel. <laughs> man, I cannot believe that you let that girl go. Yeah, man. She's crazy to pass over all of us for you. It wasn't like that. Man, I still can't believe that out of the four of us, she was only interested in you. Yeah, I'll give it to you, man. Best man won. No, guys, hound dogs. All right? It wasn't a competition. Carrie's our friend. You don't cross a line with a friend. You do that, you can't go back. I guess she's right. Yeah, that's true. But I would have won if <laughs> that's, that's what you want. Come on, man. Come on, man. Man, stay up there, man. I'm trying to. I'm trying to. Come on. Come on. Uh, what? Dustin, can you stay up there, man, please? No, Charles, hold him, please, man. Come on, last cheeseburger a week. All right, come on. One last one. One last one. Try to slide your foot out. Got one. Dusty, that's all it took. Let's go. Make it some. Fellas, you have got to see the new anchor down at the station. I mean, this woman is flying. I'm talking F O I N E. Dusty got a little crush. Call it what you will, but uh, she made a black man blush. <laughs> Hey, man, I remember my first crush, man, was on a teacher, Miss Fisher. Oof, Lord, man, she was beautiful and always wore those mini skirts. Uh -huh. Miss Fisher, Miss Fisher, what'd she teach? She taught me I was a leg man. Uh-oh. <laughs> I remember my first crush was on our babysitter. Aunt Jean? <laughs> man, that's twisted. No, man, I'm talking about Norma from down the block. She was my first kiss. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, how'd you get Norma to kiss you anyway? One day down at the lake, I faked like I was drowning. Uh -huh. She gave me mouth to mouth. I just went with it. <laughs> that's cheating. That's cheating. Oh, that's Yo, I had a wicked crush on Mrs. Phillips. Yeah, the woman uh, that worked at the cafeteria at school. <laughs> that old woman with the thing on her chin that looked like a Cocoa Puff? <laughs> thing had hair growing all out of it. She needed to put a hand net on that. Mm. Dig it, dig it. I, I mean, granted, she wasn't much to look at, but uh, she always gave me an extra dessert. <laughs> Hey, I'm not a complicated man. I just want my jello. <laughs> yeah, yeah. In the family, Here we go. that's how it's supposed to be. Between brothers, no one yeah. else can hang with me. You're my, my brother, life. brother. You're my brother, and I love you for the things you do. Even when we disagree, I got your back for you. Wouldn't trade you for the city if it came with the key. Between brothers, yo, no one else can hang with me. Because we... Keep it in the family. Oh, right. That no one else can hang with me like my brother. Lorna, I really can't explain what happened to James. I'd be happy to take a message, you know, write a note for you. You tell your brother never again, not in his lifetime, not in his wildest dreams. Oh, uh, would you like me to add love Lorna or anything like that? <laughs> Come on, there's gotta be a really good explanation why James is so late. Hey, Lorna, sorry I'm late, baby. Something just came up. <sighs> or not. I James, I've been waiting an hour. I know, I, something just came up at work, but listen, you know you're very special to me. And it hurts me to see you so upset. So look, if you just give me the chance, I'll make it up to you. Come on, let Jimmy say sorry. Mm. Mm. James. Can't you forgive me? Oh, 
How can I stay mad at you? But I can't stay. Uh -oh. I've got to go back to work. Okay. You call me? You know I will. Mm -hmm. I ain't smile for me. There she is. There's my girl. Bye, sweetie. Behave yourself. You are a special breed. Yes, I am. Of what I do not know. <laughs> Brother, there is nothing me, a rose, and a little bottle of Dom P can't solve. Hey, bro, did you take this off my tab? Oh, thank you. <laughs> James, women are not going forth for champagne and liquor store roses forever. Yeah, they are. <laughs> fellas, fellas, I have had it with that skinny little Satan. Oh, no. You're not talking about Mitchell, are oh, you? Oh, yeah. Ever since they started his divorce hearings, the man has been impossible. Comes home every night, sits in front of the TV, mumbling, just clicking the channels. Like living with my grandfather. Except I don't have to cut Mitchell's meat, all right? But I expect that day is coming. I'll be putting Salisbury steaks in the blender. Here you are, Mitchell. Drink your meat. <laughs> hey, guys. Just got back from court. Ah. It's official. I'm a single man. All right. Nah, you know what single means? What? I don't have a single thing left to my name. <laughs> she cleaned you out, huh, partner? Oh, yeah. And when the judge announced the settlement, Audrey jumped up and said, yes, and spiked her wedding ring. <laughs> hey, well, we always knew Audrey was a big football fan. That's true. Yeah, That's more. true. No? She searched. Uh, speaking of football, fellas, uh, there's a number one draft pick. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. See, now that man is unbelievable. No, that woman is unbelievable. I tell you what's unbelievable. I drove by the house today. Audrey had my golf clubs out in the garden holding up her tomato plants. Yeah, and the cat was outside playing with my golf balls. <clears throat> Excuse me, but uh, was your daddy an astronomer? Because someone put the stars in your eyes. <laughs> that has got to be the lamest line that I have ever heard. What? No, uh, try this. Uh -huh. They should change the alphabet so that you and I can be together. Seems like a little creativity. You kind of want to spice it up a little bit. Oh, how about this? Mm -hmm. I find you attractive. I'd like to get to know you better. Can I have your phone number? Nah, that wouldn't work. <sighs> so you are not going to give me your number? Oh, hell yeah. 555-0127. Five, 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 uh, mm -hmm. I'm Vanessa. I'm happy. <laughs> I'm worried, all right? Mitchell left the house with a shovel and a flashlight mumbling something about his ex-wife. Haven't seen him since. Dusty, Mitchell is a little upset, but he's not crazy. Come on, don't even go there. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Went back to Audrey's and took back what was mine. Golf! Wait, wait, whoa, whoa. Golf! Mitchell, Mitchell, oh, people Mitchell. Say golf! Mitchell! <laughs> I cannot believe you were out sneaking around Audrey's backyard. Hey, that's my backyard until Friday, okay? <laughs> Damn, I lost my other glove. <laughs> I've been with y'all all night. I think it's time. Will you show him? Mitchell, this, stop that. Mitchell, this is an ad for a group called Get Over It, all right? <laughs> they help people making the transition from divorce to single life. Why are you telling me this? Because we talked about it and you need some help, brother. You have issues. But damn the issues. What you have are problems. <laughs> hey, I'm not going, all right? Man, either you're going or I'm calling you hall to see how much it would cost to get rid of a bag full of dirty socks and a scrappy-ass dead man. <laughs> Personally, I don't see the problem. But if y'all are going to hold on to this, I'll go to your crazy little meeting, OK? But you got to go with me. I, I can't go. See, I'm a... I'm a celebrity. People might be tripping. Stop it. <laughs> Stop it right there. If you don't tell nobody, nobody's going to know. Ha, ah, fellas. I was just out with the woman who just might keep little Jimmy at home. OK, well, you just take two aspirins, and that feeling will go away. <laughs> Got jokes, all right? I'm serious, man. Vanessa's special, man. She's not one of those insecure women who just want to hang around a brother all the time, you know? I mean, she's powerful. She's independent. And she's not afraid to show her strength, you know? Who are you going out with, Xena Warrior Princess? <laughs> hey, 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 bro. What's with all the takeout? <sighs> Vanessa's coming to dinner tonight, man. You know how a woman loves a brother who can cook. <laughs> oh, stop it. Gotta sell it, you know what I'm saying? Oh, Jane. You must really like this one, because usually it's fried rice in a six-pack. Man, Vanessa is amazing, man. I mean, she completes me. 
These last few nights have just gone by in a big romantic blur, man. Theater and dancing. Hey, just the other night, we went to that new gourmet restaurant, Chez Vu. Chez Vu? Oh, that must have put a big dent in them empty pockets of yours. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't feel a thing, bruh. She paid. Stop. God, I love today's woman. Ah, oh, well, that's good, because as far as I can tell, you're becoming today's woman. <laughs> All right, you tripping, all right? I'm the man, okay? I'm running things. Yeah. Damn, my muffins. <laughs> that was close. We're alone. We're hurting. We're sleeping single in a double bed. What do we say? Get over it. All right, Charles, I'm not going in here with these losers. We've got some new faces with us tonight. Mm. Welcome to our little family. We'll help you all get over it. Well, actually, it's about him. We're just here to watch. Oh, that's what I said before I got over it. Wait a minute. I know you. <laughs> you probably do. <laughs> See, fellas, I told you this would happen. People know me. I've seen you on television, haven't I? No doubt you have. <laughs> oh, I felt so bad when Different Strokes was canceled. <laughs> Would you say it just once? What you talking about, Willis? <laughs> no, um, I'm Dusty Canyon. <laughs> Tale 64, weather warrior. <laughs> Obviously, y'all lost your televisions in the divorce. <laughs> OK, so does anyone want to get over it? Uh, you know what? We hey, got Charles, one right man. here. Where's the volunteer? Go on, hey, Charles, man. Come on, come man. on. Be the first one. Aggressive. Hi, my name's Mitchell, and I'm divorced. Get over it! Go to hell! <laughs> Look, you brought me here so a bunch of people can yell at me, Charles. Look, I'm out of here, oh, man. No, 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 no. no. That's right, that's right. Don't I'll you understand? Him. This is just something that we do. That's right, I'll help him. Look, this is our boy Mitchell. He just got divorced. He's been in court all week dividing up his property. So, you know, you can say he's been a little difficult to live with. Amen. Difficult. <laughs> all right, we could say a lot difficult. Preach on, brother. Testify. <laughs> okay, uh, I can tell you all because he stays with Man, me. Man, okay. I'll tell it. I'll tell it. All right, brother. Can you have a seat, Reverend? Tell all my business? <laughs> First of all, it's not my fault, okay? It started with Robin. Had the face of an angel and the heart of an ass murderer. <laughs> and her mama. Uh, hello? Girl, where have you been? A business meeting? You know how long I've been waiting for you? Two hours. You know, it's real inconsiderate of you to. Huh? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm wearing a gray shirt, but why? Yes, yeah, clinging to my body, but that's not the point. Don't try to distract me. Boxers? <laughs> Girl, you're so crazy. <laughs> you know, so I ain't even gonna sweat that. Uh-huh. So I told Sugar Baby, either I go or your mother goes. And that's all I can remember about the honeymoon. Okay. But let me tell you about the reception, okay? We had the bar case Well, played. those three Man, hours just crawled by. <laughs> okay, people, thanks a lot for coming. And remember, next week is south of the border night, so ole. <laughs> Come on, man, let's go. Look, partly cloudy, slight chance of rain coming in. I know, cockroach on the Cosby Show. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes I am. <laughs> you a scary little woman. <laughs> And don't forget, until the next one comes along, get over it! <laughs> you know what? I cannot believe how good I feel getting all that stuff off my chest. Well, maybe you should have kept some of that on your chest. Mm. I went there to talk, right? Now I'm talking, you tell me to shut up. Wish I could go home. James is upstairs whining and dining, and you down here just whining. Mm -hmm. See, that's why roommates have to have signals. Now, if you ever come home and you see the necktie on the doorknob, that just means I'm in there getting a little shuffling, shuffling. <laughs> How are you gonna do that when all your ties are clip-ons? <laughs> like, the tie is the problem. Hey, you don't have to wait to go home. There's James and Vanessa over there by the jukebox. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. That's not James. Hmm. But that sure is Vanessa. Look, 
Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Listen, I'm telling y'all. That was not Vanessa. James, if that wasn't Vanessa, she has a twin running around Chicago. Well, that happens. Well, from what we saw, her twin is a freak. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Come on, James. You know this hurts us more than it hurts you. Well, actually, this doesn't hurt us at all, but... <laughs> but you getting dog. Yes. I get it, Dusty. Look, you guys are wrong, man. Vanessa called and explained why she couldn't be here. She had a business emergency. Oh, she put it on you good, didn't she? Mm -hmm. Look, man, y'all don't understand, okay? When she does business, she shuts everything else out. Look, it happens to be one of the things that I love about her, man. You know, that focus. All right. We'll, have, we'll play at your way. Uh, that wasn't Vanessa we saw. And she left you here with nine courses to take out because of what? What did you say, James? Focus. Focus. Are you stupid or what, James? I saw her focus. It was on a big brother in an Armani suit. Mm -hmm. I'm not... You know what? Hello? Hey, baby. Vanessa. Hey, you know what? I'm so glad you called because I got to ask you something. Some friends of mine thought they saw you down at the corner pub. Told them they was tripped on. You were? Oh, I guess that debunks the twin theory. Yeah. <laughs> I see. It was a business associate, all right? At Get Over It, we call this denial. Yeah. You better stop. You're gonna make me blush. They're standing right here. <laughs> yeah, I still got the wine. Why? Uh huh. I can warm up a few things. Uh -huh. Like you and me. Get that. <laughs> I'll be right over. Ooh, that was a manly little episode. <laughs> hey, just because Mitchell's all up in the hate women mode doesn't mean I have to go there. Now, I'm taking my lady, and we're going to higher places. Y'all have a good evening. Mm, mm, mm. That man is getting played huh, like a Game Boy. Mm -hmm. Come on, now, he's your brother. So what are you going to do about that? He's grown. Let's eat. Mm, get the hot sauce. <laughs> What's going on? Uh, uh, whew, uh, baby, I really need to get some sleep. Oh, well, that's cool, because I'm kind of tired, too. No, no, no. I was thinking that you would sleep at your place. Oh. Oh, you mean like not here? <laughs> I just have such a busy schedule tomorrow. You're not mad, are you? Huh, me? No. Come on, I understand. Hey, baby's got to go to work. Handle hers. <laughs> I just get my keys and stuff. Go ahead. <laughs> Who's Mark? Who? Mark. His name is written here with his number on his cocktail napkin. Oh, Mark. He's this guy I work with. And what's this, his business card? Uh, baby, what are you trying to say? You know, we're lying here, it's beautiful, and then boom, I see Mark. So what, you don't trust me? Is that it? No, I'm just saying, baby. You know what? Here. You take the phone, you call Mark, you talk to him, uh, because obviously I can't be trusted. No, 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 you know what? I'm tripping. It's, it's me, it's me. No, 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 don't talk to me, you talk to Mark. No, 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 baby, I don't need to talk to Mark. See, I, I thought it was a Mark I knew, you know, because the <laughs> handwriting and everything. It, it, it's my thing, it's just me. You, you, you go ahead, you get you some sleep, and I, I'll tiptoe out. You, I'll call you. No, 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 I'll call you. You really gonna call me, right? Yeah, baby, I'm gonna call you. Night, boo. <laughs> but I'm not gonna wait around. And then she says, either you go or that satellite dish goes. <laughs> what a choice for a man to make, because see, I'm getting more sex from the satellite dish than I am from Audrey. Do you hear me? Come on, can you feel me, Greg? Huh? <laughs> Felt that Perhaps Audrey felt my narrow behind. <laughs> you guys are supposed to be my support group. Where are you? Charles Cockroach, thank God you're here. <laughs> hey, what are you guys doing here? Uh, Eileen told us to come down for your graduation. I'm graduating? What? Yeah. yeah. Because I don't feel over it. I feel right in the middle of it. I, I was, <laughs> well, I was just doing my thing. I, Here's your T-shirt, hat, and bumper sticker. Oh, if you're over it, that's my boy. I did it. I feel like I should make a speech. Or oh God, no! Please, <laughs> not necessary. <laughs> okay, people. Well, maybe we should just say goodbye to Mitchell and then 
Go. Hey, hey, this is a 12-step program. I'm only on step two. I'm not graduating, am I? Well, uh, My support group just dumped me, didn't they? No, well, it's not you. It's them, Mitch. Sometimes groups and people move apart. Come on, man. There's going to be other groups. Yeah. What about the good times? <laughs> South of the border night, man. Mm. <laughs> we made a pinata in the shape of Audrey. Bang! Boom! Bang! 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 Candy all over the place. <laughs> Funny. Hey, James. What you doing, man? Uh, uh nothing. Man, she stood you up again? No, man. She's probably just, you know, somewhere now, you know, focused on something important, you know? Stop it. Look at you. You're a mess. I'm surprised you can sit up, you spineless squid. <laughs> see, man, look, see, y'all don't know what it is, okay? What it is is... Man, y'all just don't know what it is, all right? Uh -huh. We know you sprung. Boy, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like a slinky. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. What happened to my brother James the player? The guy that can juggle three women and make them all think they're the one. The man who could meet a woman, date her, dump her, and go out with her roommate in the same week. I miss that guy. I miss him too. Well, you can be him again, because even he's better than this clown you are now. Mm -hmm. Come on, you the man. Yeah, Do something. Like Come yeah. on. And, all right, all right. And do it quick, oh. please. Here you are. Girl, you got some explaining to do. You're not mad at me, are you? I know I'm late, but I got caught up at work and lost track of time. Well, you lost track of who you're dealing with, all right? This is James Winston. He waits for no one. James. What? Jimmy. Now, you know that I care about you, huh? Hey, you know you're special to me. Yeah, well, that's what you say. You are. If you just give me a chance to make it up, Vanessa says she's sorry. Oh, that's <laughs> what you snapping for, baby? <laughs> No, she didn't. Yes, she did. Girl, a rose and a bottle of champagne? Please, you can't play James Percy Winston. Percy? <laughs> Mitchell? Give it up, girl, all right? That dog don't hunt here no more. That's right. That fish don't fly. Yeah, that rooster don't crow. And that fungus don't grow. <laughs> hey, I went last. Y'all took all the good ones. You know what? Please talk about this. I don't think so. Fellas, say goodbye to Nessa. See, See ya. ya. <laughs> Baby, when you come to your senses, you give me a call. Okay. Baby, you know hey, I want to yeah, believe you. Not even right? about that. Focus. You, you're right. You're right. You're right. right, right, right. Now, okay, all that you're talking, all right? Say why you're walking. Congratulations. All there right, it's go. good to have you back. Mm -hmm. Hey, fellas, look, there's a spine in here. I think uh, I feel it, too. Uh -huh. OK, all right, with the jokes. All right, you were right, man. Gosh, that girl really got to me, man. Yeah, all those years of dogging women is coming back on you. Sure, another other foot don't feel so good, does it? Yeah. God, you know what I feel like, man? I, I feel like, I feel like, what the hell did I just do, man? Did you see that girl with the tight skirt and the body? Excuse me, y'all. <laughs> You saw Color Money, didn't you? <laughs> Lemon ball, three rails. Boom, boom, boom. It's gonna end up back here. It's gonna kiss off the 15. <laughs> Dusty, Dusty, Dusty! What? What did I tell you the first time? You hit the ball, that's good. <laughs> this ain't golf, man. You're not putting, all right? All right, all right, all right, all right. your shot. Mitchell, your shot. <laughs> 